Good evening, Vicki. I'm just too lazy to type, so I hope you don't mind this. Um, I just came back upstairs, and I happened to look at our page, and I saw this discussion going on with Christopher Pickoff and um, John May. Uh, you were involved in it, too, and John May, um, that was prompted by the photo, which isn't her, of Claudette Foster. Claudette's uh, actually about 40 years older than that. Um, it's no big deal, uh, but I'll, you know, some of this actually rings to what we talked about the other night when I told you that Valerie was um, heading up the North American division of Garuda. Well, um, John May um, talks about that here, and um, Claudette was second in command. Uh, it's kind of interesting. Um, just to tell you how they operate. Um, one day when I was in uh, Patrons of Purgatory, which is where I met Christopher, some guy named, um, I don't know, he had like, a, you know, 15 names. He was like John Rudolph, John Roberts Rudolph, or something like that. But um, he sent me a friend request, and I had noticed, because I keep, you know, track, I know when people are in my mafia, he sent me a friend request when he joined Pop, and he said, um, I, I deleted you when you left Garuda because the um, the leadership told me to, um, and, I, you know, I want to get you back in. Well, in fact, he was wrong because I deleted him because he was a greedy son of a bitch um, over some bullshit loot, but he thinks he deleted me. That's fine. Anyway, the point of the story is, um, he said, um, we were all told to delete you when you left Garuda. So I happened to uh, be, you know, to know Claudette Foster. Um, she's a Skype contact of mine, and we've actually talked several times. I sent her a message in, in Facebook. You know, we were still friends back then. I sent her a message that said, um, hey, I just heard that, uh, the, you know, the, the, the admins and the leadership told everybody to delete me when I left Garuda, and I just want to verify that. Well, the next day when I came home from work, I noticed that I had been blocked from her account. Um, you know, it had a silhouette in the mail, which was like bizarre. But then, pending was a friend request from C.J. Foster. Well, C.J. is a name that her, uh, her husband kind of goes. She sort of, I mean, the, yeah, they all use like those initials and stuff. And um, I responded with, no, I'm not taking anybody. And she said, well, this is me because I can't get into my own account. Well, guess what? Claudette can get into her own account. She's like the number two uh, person in Quantum. Uh, she still has me blocked, but uh, if I use my niece's account, I can go to the Quantum page and I can see her posts and, and whatnot. She's very active. She's number two. She's very strong. And I'm not really quite sure how strong Valerie is, um, but she's a powerhouse. So I don't think you want to mess with them, at least those two. Maybe maybe the rest of the group isn't quite as powerful, But um, and Claudette's vicious. So after she blocked me, then for several weeks, I would notice um, that, she, that she would ice me um, in the middle of the night. And, of course, I couldn't switch her because I was blocked, but I used the Facebook ID, checked my spreadsheet, and it was the same person. It was Claudette Foster. So, anyway, um, you know, kind of what John May said here kind of ties into what I was telling you about the, the, the Garuda. And, um, and actually, uh, Valerie went off and started her own group, Quantum. So, anyway, um, this, this video will self-destruct in about, I don't know, 12 hours. So, take care. Bye.